dogs, you know, to keep barking at other dogs because it's very rewarding for a dog to keep barking. And the more they get rewarded for barking, the more they're going to keep doing it. So, you know, if you have a reactive dog, the best thing that you can do is put a yellow ribbon and move away. If, if you encounter another dog, if you know that your dog will certainly react to a dog or another, what's a reactive dog? A reactive dog is at the mere sight of another dog will start barking, will start lunging, you know, will start growling. You know, some of these are not real aggression issues. Most of it is actually coming from fear. A lot of dogs are not properly socialized so that when they encounter another dog, it's more of, oh my God, there's another dog there, it's going to bite me. And the only reaction, because they can't speak, is they'll bark. So. What you want to do is to make sure that your dogs do not bark. You do not encourage the barking at other dogs. The moment that you think that your dog will react. Oh, that's a good question. Actually, what space should we give to dogs? It really depends on the dog. Um, they call it critical distance. It's similar to personal space for, for us. So it, um, it really depends on the dog and their human. So, um, Usually the polite thing or the responsible thing is just to ask before you make contact with a dog or before approaching a dog, even if it's a yellow dog or not. That's the, I think that's probably the best thing to do. That's a safe distance. Please relax. Please relax. <laughs> it's okay. Alright. So again, if you have a dog in need of space, do not be shy about putting a yellow ribbon on your leash. The more people who are aware of this project, the better it is for our dogs who are in need of space. And Well, they can visit um, the yellowdogproject.com. It's actually a global movement, but of course, you know, it's fairly new here. Not a lot of people know about it. So I guess, you know, we just thought that it would be a nice idea to, you know, get more people aware because it's just really just individuals, I guess, who just practice on their own and you know you have to explain to people so it's really just spreading the word like maybe putting up flyers in your own communities you know so again so if you have a dog in need of space and you want to learn more about the project or you want to learn about um, some qualified trainers or behaviorists who may be able to help you and your dog overcome his space or boundary issues don't forget to don't be don't, don't be shy to check out the Alaskan Malamute page. Um, the Facebook we have a Facebook page there. It's a very active community, and um, they'll be able to help you out. So thank you for the for the time, and hopefully thank if you, you see a yellow dog, please just give him space. Thank you. Okay, thank you so much. You know, I wish I had known about this a couple years ago. I had a Belgian Malinois that uh, was a very reactive dog and got bit. So the only good thing that came out of that is he's now with a canine unit. Thank you to Alabang Town Center for adopting my beautiful Belgian Malinois named Hugo. I wonder where he is right now. I'm sure he's happy. All right. At this point, of course, we would like to thank our sponsors. Yes, we'd like to thank Easy Dog who has a booth right there, um, Royal Canal, um, Usana, CNRG, All Systems. Of course, Jamba Juice. Jamba Juice, our game sponsor a while ago, and uh, Mello 94.7, and the Philippine Weight Pool Association. And Princess, thank you for inviting me today. <laughs> All right, and another thing, I just like I just like to say it again, yeah. guys. If you see a dog with a yellow ribbon or anything yellow on their leash, give them space. I mean, they're not bad dogs, like what was mentioned earlier. They're just you know they kind of have issues like everybody else, right, and it's right. best to know these things. And please spread the word. Even if you guys don't have dogs, you know it might benefit someone who does. Might save a life even, right, of the dog or the human being. Yes, yeah. we we have available yellow ribbons at our yes. booth. Please do visit us. We have a free photo booth for you to enjoy and uh, take pictures with some of the Malamutes. And also, we'd like the, to... The non-yellow dogs. Yeah, the non-yellow dogs. Um, we'd like to finally thank Pet Express for giving us this opportunity to help promote the breed. Thank you very much, uh, Janine. Um, till the next event. <laughs> All right, so congratulations, and once again, we invite everybody to come over our booth right there at the corner. 
get your yellow ribbons if you have a reactive dog or know someone who has one and spread the word. Come visit us. We'll just be hanging out over there. Good afternoon and uh, Thank you. we'll see you around. Thank you, thank you, thank you.